You don't need no haircut? I really do need a haircut, actually. You want to cut it off? I'd love to. You got time right now? I'm heading to class, but I'll make time for this. All right, let's do it. Hell yeah. Actually, we can post up right here if you yeah, want. That's fine. All right, so what is your name and what do you do? My name is Joseph Kural. I'm a fourth year aerospace engineering major here at Georgia Tech. Yes, fire. What made you get into that? I really enjoyed stargazing with my dad. From a really young age, I decided I either wanted to be an astronaut or help send people to space. Were you nervous to cut your hair off? No, I, I've grown it out several times and it's one of those things. Every time I grow it out, it gets annoying. What led you to start getting into this? So I feel like my passion is to be a barber, but my purpose is to be able to motivate and inspire people. So TikTok gave me a platform for me to use my voice more than anything. What is it about space that you love so much? It's unknown. I think that as a species, I think we're meant to travel. So like we've explored everywhere we can here. So all that's left is space really. So you knew from day one that you wanted to work in space? That's been my goal since I would say probably about elementary school. What's the most important thing you learned this last year? You really need to think before you make decisions, especially big ones. I made some mistakes earlier this year. They've helped shape me into who I am right now, but definitely if I could go back and change some things, I would. Is there anything you regret? Uh, there's tons of things I regret, but all I can do is try to minimize the regrets I'm gonna make in the future in my life. So what would you tell somebody that can't get over a mistake they made? Time is the best medicine. No matter the level of mistake, I think, in the end, it'll be okay. You just gotta get used to the new normal. You got a relationship? Yeah, uh, I've been dating a girl for about five months now. Y'all met here on campus? Yeah, we met in an online class, actually. <laughs> COVID brought a lot of bad to the world, but I guess it did, did some good things as well. It's always gonna be a blessing in this somewhere. Yeah, you just gotta look for them sometimes. You go at it from a negative perspective, all you're gonna find is negativity. What has COVID taught you? It taught me anything, just if you have an opportunity to go do anything, take it because you don't know if you're going to have the opportunity tomorrow. What does it tell you? Don't take nothing for granted. Too many things I took for granted before, they were taken away from me. And after you can't see those people anymore, after you can't do those things anymore, you realize how much they really meant to you. So I try to wake up and just be grateful for everything I got in my life right now. What do you think a girl's going to say after she sees your haircut? I don't know because she really liked my long hair. So we'll see. <laughs> What's your favorite thing you've learned while doing these cuts? It's that humans need love. You don't really realize how much a small thing could change somebody's day or the way they feel. Showing love don't cost a dollar. Hell yeah. Thank you so much, man. I love it. Like a brand new person. Whew. Yeah, really though. <laughs> I guarantee you I'm gonna go into classes and see friends later and they're not gonna recognize me. You all good. Thank you so much again, man. Bro, yeah, again, yeah. Pleasure to meet you. You keep doing what you do, man. Man, likewise. Oh, see try. you in space one day. <laughs> I make a wig out of this now.